So now I'm going to look at some uh, exercises to improve shoulder extension. Um, so one of your stretches, if you are limited in shoulder uh, extension, was to come practice in the thoracic bridge positions. So for the strengthening exercises, similar positions, you can play around with your hand position. So either hands back, you can play around with the different positions pointing forward. And then from there, from whatever hand position feels good for you to start, all you're going to do is rock forward and back, squeezing your shoulder blades together. Then we're going to start a variation uh, level two, where we are looking at uh, progressing into a reverse plank. So you'll extend one leg out in front of you, and then you'll scoop under through your hips, You'll lift the hips up, looking towards your knees, and then come back down. And then other side, lift up with the hips, coming back down. And you should feel a strong stretch. You might feel it through the biceps up into the front of the shoulder. So that would be level two. You would probably do around kind of 10 reps, five on each side, and do two to three sets. Level three, you would be going into a full reverse plank. So again, choose your hand position and see if you can do it in all the three different hand positions. So I'm going to show you. So squeezing the bum, lifting up as high as you can. So this is reverse plank. So you would just come in and out of reverse plank, squeezing those shoulder blades together, maybe 10 reps. Have a little rest, shake your arms out, and then do another two to three sets. Then we move into thoracic uh, bridge. We're going to add a little bit of thoracic extension, which is really nice for our shoulders. So one hand back, you'll push through the feet, lift up as if you're coming into a glute bridge, reach and look back at the hand beneath you, big reach with the arm, and then come back down, pressing up, coming back down, really trying to reach as much as you can. If you can get lower, you're trying to aim to get that hand as close to the floor as you can. You would do 10 on the one side and then 10 on the other side. And you want to be practicing these exercises every day.